Hey, do you like the anime One Piece? Do you like video games? You won't anymore. This is One Piece Online, a browser-based MMO from Joy Games, which is ironic because I don't feel the slightest bit of joy while playing this whatsoever. Finally, you can play as none of your favorite characters. I think, I don't really know the show. Instead, you'll play as a busty, scantily clad anime woman, which can just be shortened to every anime woman ever, a gun-toting, super skinny, badass anime guy, which can just be shortened to every anime guy ever, and a cutesy, pigtail little anime girl who's obsessed with adorable animals, which can just be shortened to every anime girl ever. I think it's pretty obvious which one I'm gonna choose. She's just too adorable. Then you're off. Yeah, I could start my adventure, but I'd rather just listen to this sweet music. Okay, that's enough. Let's start. We'll just auto path to this guy, hit submit task, and BAM! Level 2! Yeah! Progress! Let's just click the button and automatically auto path to the next location, which is Luffy! I know that guy! And somehow seeing a character I know doesn't make me feel any better. Click on some more buttons, auto path some more. BAM! Level 3! The amount of self satisfaction I have right now is at an all time high, and simultaneously at an all time low. That's a little weird. After clicking a few more prompts, it's time for my first fight. Heck yeah. Throughout all of this, by the way, you might have noticed something a bit off about the translation. It's really, really bad. But that's okay, I'm sure the combat's amazing. I can't wait to do absolutely nothing. Seriously, I did not touch the mouse or the keyboard throughout all of this. And in case you don't believe me, I took video of a fight just to show you. I got three stars though, so yay, I guess. God, I wanna die. Auto path, click some buttons. Level four, bitches! At this rate, I'll be max level and who gives a f Battle number two! At this point, I literally got up and went and made myself a cup of tea. In my household, whenever I'm playing a game and my wife needs me to do something, she'll usually say, when you're out of battle, can you do blank? But oddly enough, while playing One Piece Online, the phrase changed to, whenever you get into battle, can you go do blank? It's just that action packed. I just can't take my eyes away! After the second battle, you are given a companion, which I'm pretty sure is a character from the show. So this is probably really fun for fans of the anime. I guess. Maybe? Who am I kidding? No, it isn't. You'll then get to choose one of two factions to join. Either the strong world or the worst generation. I went with the latter because they're rebels who want to overthrow world structures and stick it to the man. It also really expresses how I feel about this game. I auto path some more and achieved another level, which I'm starting to feel like might be a bit pointless. Hey, I got a joke for y'all. In One Piece Online, what's the difference between a level 1 and a level 7? Answer, 6 clicks. <laughs> I kid, I kid. It's actually 43, I counted. Another battle where I do nothing, more clicking, autopathing, more doing nothing, until I eventually fight Garp. Here's where the game introduced my first combat skill, and here's how it works. Click on the skill, click on an enemy. BAM! And you can only use it once per fight. Man, this adds a whole new layer to the game. Clicking twice during combat! I can't wait until I unlock my second skill, if I can make it there before killing myself. And I've only been playing for 15 minutes. After that fight, I was awarded with another companion, Zoro. Okay, now that guy I definitely know. Turns out there's more to this game than just clicking on prompts. You can actually level up and train your companions, and you can even search for gold, which involves some timers and just more clicking. But at least it breaks up the monotony a little bit. Hey, shut up. I gotta find the positives where I can. So you'll fight some more people and... No, 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 no! No! Two stars? I don't deserve to live anymore! Turns out the longer you play the game, the more you might actually have to start clicking in combat to tell your character who to attack. I continued to play the game until around the end of chapter one, but I just couldn't keep going. I could only recommend this game to small children and possibly ultra mega diehard fans of the anime. Even then, I'm not really sure they're gonna wanna play this either. And who knows, maybe this game gets amazing the higher level you get, but I'm sure as hell not gonna be the one to find out. I'll leave that to someone else who actually likes slowly destroying their own soul. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Make sure to visit MMORPG.com for all of your MMO related news. And if you like this video, make sure to visit my YouTube channel for more silly videos.